I did the Tonight Show because nobody wanted to do it. It was live. It was live, so I just go down. I just, it was grim. I'd go down there after work. The Hudson, Hudson Theater was a filthy place. And 45th Street was the home of hookers and pimps. It was a terrible atmosphere to work in, but that's where we started the Tonight Show. Because I don't think, they didn't think it would work, so. I remember the meeting when Pat Weaver called us in and said he had this idea to do what we call service shows. That was the Tonight Show, the Today Show, and a show called Home with Arlene Francis, which didn't work, but she was a wonderful lady. I worked with her many times on television. But that was the beginning. It started from a very simple meeting on the eighth floor. We just sat and listened to Pat Weaver tell us what, he, what we were going to do. How did he describe the Tonight Show in that meeting? Vaudeville. It was a vaudeville show. He, he, uh, how can I say this gracefully? It only had to do with greed. They wanted to somehow capture a network market later because they could, it was very simple, they could make money doing it. The network could make money, not the local station because that was a split cost factor. And that was one of the big problems when we started NS. I said, I think when we started, we had two stations, New York, and I think we had Baltimore, I think was that. That was the first station. And then we read on the road, everybody forgets that. We went on the road with The Tonight Show and played Chicago, uh, Baltimore, uh, Dallas, Omaha. I don't know, we played. Can you imagine carrying this bunch of gypsies? I mean, we didn't know. It was such insanity. We had no idea what we were doing.